Now what you are about to hear and witness is disastrously harmful to your ears and eyes. So be aware. Because today, you and I will uncover the secret behind file 1207. Now, let us begin as we travel into the world, the mysterious world of the unknown files. This is day one, uh, phase one of. This is Jay Crumbing signing in for day one. Oh, this uh, damn, nigga. It seems like my control over my inner self has lost its touch. I have tried to keep him calm with. In a controlled environment, and it seems like he has figured out that it, this is not real. I can no longer control him. From this day on, we will be sharing a body. This is probably the last message you'll get from Jay. Because Jason has now Jason has now been Jake Crumby is an awesome person and believes that he can change the world. I said jump down, fucker. Could you describe Jay the best way possible? Jay's reputation precedes him. A teacher had him before I did and regards him very fondly and said that he would fit in and be a wonderful addition to the class. And sure enough, the first day of school, he was already wanting to create things, um, expresses artistic side by creating a class logo. He has been someone who gets along with his classmates um, and is all around very well liked. Thank you. But others only bring him down. Yet Jay stands up and keeps on running. He will always look at you with a smile. Has he ever mentioned Jason? No, I realized that I know his full name, actual Jason, uh, through Jaden. That's how I figured it out. Hmm. Seems like I need to go to Jaden next. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, this my jam, nigga.
now you're wondering why I made this documentary. I made it so people can get to know me better. So they know my backstory. I just expressed to you the person that I left behind long ago. That was Jason Kirby. He uh, was also me, but wasn't me at the same time. I've been left in the dark for two, for so long. I wasn't able to talk to people, connect to people, or even have a smile on my face like I do every day. I usually cared about what people thought of me and always came home to cry about it. I didn't have anyone to talk to unless my parents figured out that I was sad or something. Um, I did have people come up to me and try to talk to me. But I didn't know what to do or say. Now I do have lots of friends, but I don't declare them friends, I declare them brothers and sisters. There are some people that I declare my besties because everyone has a very different connection with me. When I came to high school, I decided that I was going to be someone different, not just the person that I really was. I wanted to be someone else. So I became J. Crumby. I just took the sun off, that's all. Uh, I just want to let you know that since I have changed, I've been able to do a, a lot of things. Explore new, new, uh, explore new things, experience new stuff. Like I became somewhat of a poet. Oh, this my jam, I do sometimes make music. I make art a lot because I want to be a graphic designer and a video game designer, so I gotta be able to do that both. Nowadays, people make fun of me for my views, my opinions, what I say, how I talk, where I'm from, my race, basically any, any, any topic that concerns me in the slightest. I usually was be able to be phased by everything like that and then be able to speak on that truth. And I still can speak on that truth, but I'm not phased by it anymore. I changed oh, a lot. That's my jam, nigga. And as a senior now, I've made it here. I mean, who should I be when I get out of high school? Jay? Or should I be Jason? I wanna let you know. Me and Jason, we usually tend to fight against one another for who gets the spotlight. And Jason gets the spotlight Like when I'm at home, he gets the spotlight. And I wanna let him talk about what he needs to talk about to y'all. Cause I told my I've told my part now it's his turn out to tell this. Go ahead, Jason.
myself in the dark. I didn't have many friends. I didn't talk to anyone. I didn't have anyone to go to if I was. I would just. If I if I needed to get away from somewhere at this at school, it would be go to the safe room. Just that's where I used to be. They're, they're basically kind of counselors, but it's a safe room. And I just, I just needed someone to think. Yeah. And yeah. Uh, no one was there. And every time a person like that or someone that wants to be my friend, there's no one to be found when I do need them the most and uh Jay has all the cool personalities, but I got all the emotions. And we usually come together on things when someone really does need us the most. Because we we know that we don't want anyone else in the dark. Oh, this my jam, nigga. We've learned a lot from school, other people, their thoughts and opinions. Through our own eyes, too. We've learned a lot. And now that we're almost out of here, I'm just the first personality. Jay is the first personality that I've ever had. Oh, this my jam, nigga. A traumatic experience. Sorry, I messed up on that. And every time I, I just have him inside. If I'm out and Jay's inside, I can feel the pain. How I got him to become a personality. So I keep him out so I can be in. Y'all, y'all probably think that, oh, this is just the act that he puts on. This is just something for the film. This is. This documentary, documentary is yeah. I do have multiple personalities that I think are real, but people can't see.
needed a friend. No one was around. I couldn't call no one. I couldn't text oh, no one. Jam, nigga. Jay would be right there next to me. The whole way through. Now, we speak to you on 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 this. This is how we end this. This film. our point of view or for help at all we know what our dream is we know how we'll get there and oh that's my jam nigga me and Jay together lots of people and obtain a lot of friends, sisters and brothers all together. I hope you don't get sucked into the darkness as I am because I couldn't see no light at the end of a tunnel. I couldn't see no light and I could not seek it. But when Jay became my light, I was able to believe, to have hope. Jason is a part of me, and I feel his emotions. I will change this world for the better. Nigga, when